We are about to pull in to Margaritaville. How do you feel? Tired. Yeah, I feel tired too. 16 hour drive will get you. Yeah, but it's exciting. Mm -hmm. We are pulling up to Margaritaville. Unfortunately, they're doing construction in our hallway, um, so that kind of stinks, but the room is nice as always. We got two queen beds just because it's um, a little bit cheaper. So there's a bathroom, standard bathroom, sink with the cute little whale fixtures, nice size shower. Here's a closet. There is an iron, I believe, in the, yep, there's an iron in the closet. Oh, it's a conjoined room. There's a big mirror here. Whoop, there's Scott. Cool little decor. Say so, hey, they also gave us our welcome rum punch, so that's pretty cool, along with a bunch of other literature, directions, and menus, and things like that. Um, there's a TV, a little coffee bar kiosk, cute little plane, and this is the view from our balcony. So we have our two little Adirondack chairs, and we are by the pool that has the salty rim bar and grill, which is a nice view. Excuse the construction noise. Other than that, it's really nice. Margaritaville Resort, we're heading into Euphoria for their brunch. We've never had it here, we've just had their, their dinner. So let's see, it's a really nice, cute little place here. live entertainment that they have once in a while in the lounge. So we chose to sit on the outdoor patio. I'll show you the view. There's kind of a wraparound side. The pools are back here. It's really nice out here. It's actually a nice day, so we're not too uh, warm, but they do have ceiling fans to make you more comfortable. And then here is the brunch menu. are the brunch cocktails. They also do bottomless mimosas, if you're into that. All right, so they brought us over a little thing of pastries. This looks like um, a croissant texture, and this looks like a little poppy seed muffin. And it looks like they made it out to be a dolphin tail. Pretty cute. The tropical sangria has some raspberries and orange garnish. It tastes amazing. If you are a sangria fan, I would 100% try this. All right, this Guida Eggs Benedict looks so good. So with the breakfast potatoes, look at that. And look at these chocolate chip pancakes with fresh berries on the side. So delicious, everything. Headed into the Margaritaville store. You can get t-shirts, you can get swimsuits, you can get um, cups, mugs, games. Lots of different things in here. Dog bowls even. Oh, here's their glasses. All right, so we're heading down to the pool. You have to use your wristband in order to get into 
the gate. Um, they also do provide towels for you here. And then we'll just show you. So here's the gate. You should put your little wristband. And it opens and voila. Here at the pool. So there's a couple of different pools. There's one over here and then there's one towards the Salty Rim Bar and Grill. There's also um, a couple of hot tubs and all of the, the pools kind of have this walk on shallow area, which is good if you have kids, there's no designated kiddie pool. So just look at these, these views. They play music, sometimes they have live music too. I think every day they're supposed to at a certain um, time frame. You can see there's umbrellas, there's also cabanas that you can rent if you'd like to. I think at three or 4 p.m is when the live music starts and it's just it's a cool atmosphere when that does happen um so let's see so yeah this pool right here four foot deep so the pools don't get very very deep for jumping or diving or anything like that there's one we'll show the other one here's one of the hot tubs it's actually pretty big so three foot deep it does get pretty hot um sheet seating right there and you could fit at least 20 people in these um, and then we're headed towards the other the other pools and you can see the salty rim bar and grill is going to pop up around the corner and here we can kind of get a peek into some of the cabanas so you have a little fridge some chairs and a tv and a fan i'm not sure of the price of those um, and then here is the other pool same, same exact thing. Pretty much identical to the other one. And it does have shelving right here. And I believe it's a saltwater pool, but I'm not 100% sure on that. And then you have the cabanas back here, the lake. It's all super nice. All right, we got the menu here for the Salty Rim Bar and Grill. The servers will come around to take your order so you don't even need to get up from your lounge chair. Um, so they have some bites, island greens, dessert, handheld, kids menu now. It's actually pretty extensive. Um, some drink choices. And then on the back there's more cocktail options. Handcrafted cocktails and things like that. So um, we ordered two rum therapies, which is something that used to be on the menu. Um, it's not on the menu anymore, but they could still make them and we highly recommend it. They're, they're amazing. So yeah, and there you can see the little beach area over there and it's just, it's a really nice, really nice day. Here's the rum therapy. Scott, is it as good as you re remember? Oh, it's great. Best drink down here, 100%. Get yourself one. So we won a free cabana because we won a trivia game that they um, hosted, so that's exciting. And then we also got the chicken nachos. Amazing. My second favorite is the Coco Rita. It is amazing. It has a hint of coconut. Um, it's kind of like a margarita with a hint of coconut rum. It is amazing. It's a beautiful sunny day here today. We have the lake behind us. We're gonna get our cabana today that we won in trivia. Get some lunch. It's gonna be great. We're gonna see if one of those are available. They're kind of nice um, on the corner. It's a little bit more of um, a closer look at some of the cottages. Some of them um, have their own pools and are along the lakeside. There's also a cute little area with Adirondack chairs. It looks like it's a fire pit. I would assume that you can um, maybe do a little bonfire with your party. Um, here's another beach area. This one's near the Salty Rim Bar and Grill. The bathrooms are back there. They have some games here. We have our guest towel area right here. You can get sunglasses and there's some swim floaties and things like that. So it looks like they have cornhole. Um, can I floor? Is that what that game is? I think so. And a giant checkers. 
And then there's an activity guide of different things that they do throughout the week. I think they change them up a decent amount. But yeah. So that's this area. Here they are. Sun screen. Cute little pool floaties. There's also no lifeguard. Alright, so we have our TV that you can change. This is just what she set up. They put towels on this for you. You have little drawers. A remote, which she said it's a hundred dollars if you lose this, so don't lose your remote. Another lounge chair. So we chose this one. Um, it's a little more private, I'll show you. We chose 13. There's one to this way, and this one I think is just has a couch, so there's kind of different styles you can get. Um, yeah, so this is our cabana. It has a ceiling fan and everything, and the waiters will come around and take your, your food and drink order. So, And there's a little walk-on right here, which is nice. All right, so I got the shrimp tacos. It looks like they give you a decent amount of shrimp. And really good fries, though. They're good fries that have that little crunch on the outside. And I'm actually in the pool right now. There's our cabana. I'm still in the pool as I'm gonna eat them, but I'm gonna eat them over here so I don't get any of the mess in the pool. They're doing big well right now. So I did say there are activities that you can do every day. The sky's a little dark, but it hasn't rained, thankfully. Oh, uh, Scott got a cheeseburger. Let's see. Cheeseburger in paradise, that's what they're going for. Wow, you can just see that cheese just so melty on top. Two patties too. Two patties, there you go. Good, good eats here. I got this uh, little floaty for $13 over at the towel area. They have a popsicle too, and they have a bunch of other things. But this is good because you can actually be in the water while you're on your floaty. So I'm going to go enjoy this bad boy. 